Guys, welcome back to Caesar 3 and we are here on part 2 of the final military mission and the final mission in this campaign, Lindum, where we are doing the heretic city or the monotheistic city, where we're only allowed one god and all the other gods are annoyed at us. So in the first part, we established our city against all odds and we have Venus on our side because the Venus curse is actually the most difficult curse to deal with. So in this part, we're gonna try to establish our city, maybe get a few people fed, and try not to die to the gods. So let's go ahead and get things started. All right, guys, welcome back to Caesar 3. We're here on Lindum. We've got all of these towers set up, and I think there are more invasions. Oh, no more invasions are on the way. So, Right now, all we have to do is focus on trying to maximize our exports and survive against the gods, really. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to maximize um, meat export by doing this. And I'm going to put down an engineer's post right there. So because we are going to be expanding up that way, Mercury is still... They're still wrecking our warehouses. Don't worry about that, don't worry about that. We're about the point of stabilization. Mercury keeps burning down this one because I think Mercury burns down the most full uh, warehouse. And we've almost got enough vegetables to send this off as well. So I'm still not happy with the number of towers we have here. I would like to have another one or two going. So I think I'm just gonna place one more right here. Get out of the way. I'm gonna have one more tower there. And I would like a second row of towers here. And maybe a couple more down here as well as we wall all of this off. Um, which reminds me, I probably should just wall this off right now. Make sure no one can. Don't worry about that. Okay, so at least the invasion points are generally walled off. I'm leaving this open because if they, if this starts to fall, I'd rather them run, try to avoid the wall pass all these towers that will be good okay yeah three meat warehouses should be able to maximize that this is now clearing off okay okay so all the gods are unhappy except for venus by the way venus in case you don't know her curse she sends disease to wreck houses and and that is a, a huge problem because if she wrecks houses, not only does it cost money to rebuild the houses, it keeps dropping your population. So you can only do so much. So one thing I kind of, how much is it to build a gatehouse? A hundred? If I could just hook up all of these roads, it would make building and maintaining towers a little bit easier rather than rebuilding Oh, we have enough. Series wrecking our farms. Don't worry about that. We'll send off the vegetables there. Oh, no. Undo that, please. Sorry. Uh, let us... I'm, what, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to hook up all of these areas with a gatehouse. And then... This does cost a little bit of money, but it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. So we're just gonna do this. So we don't have to keep rebuilding the barracks. And look at that. We, we've already got a decent amount of money here. So I'm gonna do that. So now the barracks is connected to all of these walls. And I can just build another tower down here. and not have to worry about moving my barracks around. Okay, good. How's our employment, by the way? We are short on employees. So I should probably try bring in a few more people here. Our money is going up, so that's good. These exports, so we don't want these warehouses to fill up too much because if they do fill up, what were you gonna buy, meat? Okay, we should maximize that next year. Uh, series does stop 
uh, meat production as well, by the way. Ah, yes, we're selling some furniture. Whenever we avoid... As I was saying, whenever we avoid a Neptune curse, boats come in and buy some furniture. Uh, is Venus looking angry as well? No, no, Venus is happy. Venus is fine. Uh, the Mars curses are a little concerning because they send troops. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna test something here. I'm actually gonna just try build a couple towers on the back here. And see if these ballista can shoot across to hit the, the enemy spawning up there. Because if that is something we can do, then we can just get to... Uh... Which one? Oh! Burnt, burnt the decoy one! Yes! Mercury, screw you! You burnt the decoy warehouse. Uh, was it because it was the most full? I think it was. Oh, would you look at that? Yeah, we're keeping this one on getting furniture just to bring some furniture over. Then I let this overflow with furniture and usually Mercury burns that one. Anyway, crops are growing again. How's employment? Uh, I think I do have to keep stockpiling vegetables. So I'm just gonna build another vegetable. All right, all right. By the way, we're basically playing They Are Billions. We're basically playing They Are Billions. <laughs> Just holding off the hordes of zombies. Inspired by Mars. So, gonna build another farm there. These towers should be able to deal with the Mars curses. No problem. They always dodge the second volley, interestingly enough. And the Mars curse also wrecks one of our javelin forts, by the way. Okay, there we go. So we should have enough towers there. I'm only concerned about the primary invasions now. And actually, if I'm gonna build towers here, we can't have that road there. Because we can't have the towers touching the back there. Okay. The gods are wrathful, guys, if you haven't noticed. Now, let's uh, replace the decoy warehouse and set this to getting furniture as well. Just to bring some of that over. Can this not get more furniture? Is it because it's got... Oh, it's got an odd number of furniture. Okay, I see. Uh, meat's coming back in. We are exporting clay and pottery as well. I don't know if we maximized that last year. I'm not sure if they, I don't think they can buy 50 units, so it should be fine. Employment shot by 36. Just spam some wells here. There's Ceres wrecking things again, and I'm just gonna do that. Just to bring in more people. Okay, okay. Oh, actually, I kind of don't want to stockpile too much vegetables because then things will start getting wrecked. Well, the only other export we can go is weapons. Which, should I bother? Because it's just... Weapons are worth more, right? 180, 150... Maybe I sh just shouldn't bother. Maybe I just shouldn't bother. Um, yeah, so let's try get some sort of... There's only one farming area, right? Yeah. Well, besides this here. Let's try get one area fed, okay? So I'm just gonna build a nice little uh, village down here. Uh, actually, maybe I'll build it over this side between... Yeah, this looks like a good area. For just a little village. And, by the way, there's no block requirements on this map, so I'm just gonna build a standard rectangle. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Maybe we can get a basic block going. Which one? That one? Okay. So we can do this, do this. Get some houses going here. Fill this up. Engineer's post. And we'll put down a doctor as well. Employees needed, okay. Uh, and one, two, three. Engineer's post. And we can actually try get a granary going. Really? An invasion? An invasion is on the way. So are people gonna be, yes, yes. So we can put down the granary. Farm, vegetable, fruits, pigs. Mercury might burn down the granary as well. Perhaps I can put a warehouse right here and set that to accepting any surplus timber. And maybe that can act as a decoy for... for... Mercury. If we do this... To just accepting furniture. Yeah. I'm not sure if we sold it. I think we did sell some furniture there. Right? We sold nine this year. Okay, so we are gonna be moving some people in here. Okay, let us get. Uh, how do I wanna do this? Click and drag for the special tactic here. Yeah, okay. yeah, that should do. Fountain, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's a little annoying. I'm gonna need a reservoir here as well. Okay, so we can start evolving that. Farm, vegetables, fruits, or pigs. You know, let's go fruits. And just try... How many farms do you think we need to feed that much? Six? Oh. We cannot have these touching the granary, because if mercury burns the granary... That will be bad. Six, maybe? Fifteen furniture. Well, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Yeah, just dispatch that. That's fine. Okay. Employment. We've got unemployment. Once these farms are online, that should be dealt with. <clears throat> okay, this granary is... Did I set it to not accepting? Accepting fruit. Okay. Alder, welcome to the stream. What have you missed? Uh, we're just trying to get a basic block fed and going. And then we'll see <laughs> if... Uh... Do we really not produce enough wood to stockpile? I guess not. This warehouse here... I think I'll build a second warehouse and set this to getting vegetables so we can can I set this to getting vegetables as well no 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 I shouldn't do that what I should do is I should set a warehouse here to getting vegetables 
This way we can keep stockpiling vegetables without mercury burning down these warehouses because there's only eight units of things in there. Right? So we can have like backup warehouses along here. Because I know Caesar starts asking for a lot of stuff on this mission. It's a little hard to win this mission doing this challenge if you don't have uh, a little bit of foreknowledge. So these farms are just not going to grow for a while. <laughs> oh. Engineer post on the farmland side in case the granary burns down. That's a good point. And we can stick a single house back there, actually, for some stability. Yeah, because if the granary burns down, then there's no road connection. Right, right, right. Okay. So these houses moved in, dealt with some employment issues. Mercury's cursing a lot, huh? Okay. Burnt down a decoy one. Surely surplus timber should come in here. Hmm. Well, we've got... How much do they carry? 400, right? Yeah. We'll keep some vegetables stockpiled around the map. Okay. Lots of money has come in, though. Look, look at that. Oof. Okay. Okay. I guess I'll just continue... Reinforcing here. And also, just to test, I guess I'll do this. Wow, we actually have a, a fort of javelins. Well, next Mars curse, they're gone. Fruits may be finally coming in. Not a single unit has come in yet. set this to getting vegetables do I need to do this? I don't think so Okay. so 600 units of vegetables stockpiled, okay some timber's gonna stockpile here and eventually mercury will hit that one hmm. okay, okay 500 units of fruits coming in Okay, Wrath of Ceres, yeah, yeah, okay. No more farming for a while. Everyone, hold up. Okay, these towers are coming online. This should be able to hold off anything. For... I'm gonna move this. Engineer's post. Doctor. Since we have money, I'm just gonna do this. At least, if they break through... They will be facing things anyway. Second line of defense, not the worst thing in the world. Okay. In case you're wondering why no sentries, because sentries aggro the troops, so they might charge a little early. Put one there as well. So that should definitely be able to hold off anything. Okay, okay. The other sides should all be fine. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight towers there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven towers there. There's the Wrath of Mars. Okay, they can shoot over the walls. That one shot? I think so, I think so. Two thousand people. And you guys says overconfidence might be your downfall. I spent like two and a half hours losing this map. I'm not that overconfident. I'm just pretty sure that. Come on. I'm 
pretty sure we'll be okay. We're just struggling to get the first feeding. I'm gonna need like a pretty full granary here, but... Huh. An actual invasion, okay. Let's see if the towers work. Let's see if the towers work. It should be from here, yep. Okay, obliterate them, come on. Wreck all of them. Okay, okay. It's going well. They probably got... Oh, a stray ballista actually hit one of the chariots and they just immediately booked it. The nice thing is you don't have to kill all of the troops. Once their morale is too low, they just book it. And all the back towers have been firing. Perfect. I think these two didn't because of the cliff wall, but it's still, it's still fine. Okay. Wrecked, says Aldo64. Okay. 1,200 food. I guess we should just start distributing that because Mercury's gonna burn this down pretty soon, I think. These guys trying to grab more vegetables, but there's no vegetables to grab. Okay. I think we are still selling some furniture, right? Yeah, we've sold 12 units this year. We just can't max out our exports, so we gotta keep an eye on our... Um, Come on, grab some food before Mercury burns this down. Okay, yes, thank you. Grabbing some food. Distribute that, please. Evolve that, please. Um, right, we need a temple here. We're only allowed Venus. Venus, come on down. We should be able to evolve this a little bit. Let's go theater. Let's go amphitheater. Employees needed, don't worry. These houses will evolve. We'll need a school as well. That should cover it, right? Okay, first feeding should be done with this next volley of fruits. Okay, too little entertainment. Evolving, evolving, no basic educational facilities. Okay, well... At least we got through the first feeding. Okay, that's gonna bring in so many more people. So I think with this amount of food, it is all evolved. Right? Yes, every house has been fed. Okay, perfect, perfect. We're getting things going. At least Venus won't just smash all your lovely built-up housing. Yeah, that's why I don't think this challenge is possible. That one? Okay. I don't think this challenge is possible um, with Venus wrecking houses because we feed all of that. Venus can just wreck this whole block with a severe curse. It just it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Okay. And I'm pretty sure... Because the enemy troops show up group at a time, if we can have enough ballista to wreck each group as they appear and make them turn around, it should be enough. It should be fine. Did I get another tower here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, eight towers there. Eight towers there. So that can handle the Mars invasions, and I'm pretty sure all other invasions come from here. There's that Mars invasion. The worst place to invade me from. <laughs> And we do have gatehouses out there, just in case we have a, any troops to send. But I don't think we're going to be having any troops. Okay, okay. Lizaran just subbed for 12 months in a row. Lizaran, thank you so much for sticking around for a whole year. Okay, so now we need some pottery here to distribute. So grabbing it is probably not a good idea because it'll just be bought anyway. So let me just do this. Warehouse. Do that. Set this to... I just need this to not accept timber and I think then it's fine. Right? Yeah, because all the timber will just stockpile into there. 
meat clay pottery. Yeah. Uh, how are our meat exports, by the way? I think we are actually maxing out meat exports. Some food should start coming in here. I think I have to... extend the road down like this so that I can go raw material, clay pit, workshop, pottery, warehouse, that's... reservoirs can't burn down, right? Okay, I'm just gonna put it there and set this to accepting just pottery. Doesn't matter actually. Okay, some fruit comes in, allows us to evolve that. Needs access to bathhouse, we can do that. Uh, did all the schools hit? Yes. Okay. How's our employment? No employment problems. I'm just gonna put down two more fruit farms, I think. Just to try and stabilize this a little bit. I'd like a little surplus coming in. I think we actually have enough. But as more people move in... Why are people moving out? I've got nowhere to live. Do they run out of food? Or is it the desirability? Uh, let's just plaza it up, shall we? Plaza it up. Uh, yeah, they ran out of food. So we do need a little bit more food. But it really depends on when the series curses come in. Is this affecting our prosperity at all? Oh, we're at 10. So, because we can't produce a lot of food, my goal is to just have a few luxury palaces somewhere here on the farmland, easy to manage, maybe just at the edge of the map here. Because we just need that prosperity boost and a bit of tax income will help stabilize things as well. Okay, there we go. People moving back in, moving out. They ran out of food, yeah. We, we need a bit more food here. Which one? Yes! Mercury burnt the decoy! <laughs> uh, isn't it nice when a plan comes together? Hmm. We could do it without temples to Venus and just have festivals? Possibly? But I need to build temples anyway to evolve houses. Um, can you do it with festivals? You definitely couldn't do it at the start because we needed all the money to build these towers. I think we did the math. In the first few years of setting up defenses, we spent about 7,000 denarii. What about culture? Okay, well... Yeah. So we need more fruit farms. Because since evolving the houses... Yeah. What about culture? Culture is 60. Um... It's currently zero. It's probably because, yeah, our population is way too high. It's okay, this will be a little bit of a culture dump. I know temples contribute to culture as well, so we just have to check. Hmm. Okay, from here. <laughs> oh, it's a slightly bigger group here. Yeah? yeah, just by timing, they always dodge the second volley. Now, I do wonder, I don't think we'll get to see it, but... If they ever run, will they ever- will they run towards the towers or up this way? I'm not too sure. Okay. Oh, we got some pottery in. Needs more entertainment. Right, we need to get the... Gladiator school going. Uh, I should probably put down the actor colony as well. Move the engineer's post up a bit. That should still reach. There is one house there, right? Yeah. yeah. Fruits are growing again. Oh. Oh, did you see that? 
The farms I put down after Ceres' curse could continue to grow. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I gotta test that next time. Wait, where is... What? What is... What? You shouldn't be able to do that. Warehouses shouldn't be able to grab from other warehouses set to getting. Well guys, we have discovered a new bug in Caesar 3. This game is riddled with bugs. I've played this game for so many years and I've never seen this one. Fixed. Fixed. <laughs> no wonder why he's pushing carts all day long. Okay, we're struggling to feed this area, but I think we'll get there soon. We'll get there soon. Okay, okay. Some of these evolving. Okay, great, great. That is not close enough to hit that, I see. But this is? Okay, so... Which one? That one, okay. Let's keep the timber going. Why do we have so much pottery here? Oh, it's a New Year's. Okay, okay. Um, so what this basically means is we need to have... ...a house here. A couple medium statues. Okay. Let's make this look actually nice. Medium statue in the middle. Surrounded by small statues. Okay. Uh, we can also plaza up this back road. There we go. Evolve those. Needs a supply of furniture. Oh, so we can actually set this to getting furniture. Because that's a sea trade route, so it's fine if we do that. Housing being there. Okay, so yeah, now that's, that's working. Okay. That housing should stabilize the block here. We still don't have a surplus of food yet. I'm not sure if I'm overproducing pottery. I don't want to produce more pottery than we're consuming here. So I might actually destroy one pottery workshop. Because pottery is not consumed that fast. Hmm. Let's get rid of this. Set that to just not accepting timber. We'll try and streamline these things as much as possible. Okay, is food... Food is still not stabilized. We've got quite a lot of farms here. I think the... Oh, some of these houses still aren't fed. Okay, yeah, it's, it's not stabilized yet. It should eventually stabilize. Oh, we need a fountain here. Oh, no, no, we can't be there. Uh, I'll put the fountain here. Statues can't burn down, right? Statues can't burn down? As far as I understand? This might be a large invasion. Darius asks, what is a heretic city? Yeah, the gods are constantly angry. Except for Venus, because winning with Venus angry is impossible. Statues can't burn down, okay. Okay. Series curse. Let me test something. Let me test something. Slow the game down. And I know we're wrecking invaders here. Where are these guys from? Celtic? It's the Celts. Okay. Also, to stabilize... Um, employment, I'm just going to put a house there. Farm, fruits. Okay. 
Does this work? Does this work? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. By the way, we have to do this because we cannot support a military. Because every military fort we have uh, is constantly wrecked by the Mars curses. Okay, okay. Oh, they're actually managing to attack here. Ooh, they touched the wall. They touched the wall. Set priority to food production. We have unemployment, it's fine. Look at that, we, we can mitigate. Yes! Series, screw you. You can curse us all you want. Look how much money we've got. We can just rebuild farms. <laughs> uh. Someone pointed out that since the year is 8100, uh, and us converting to just one god, um, Rome going monotheistic is thematically appropriate. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Isn't that interesting? Okay, some furniture has come in. We can provide that now. Okay, great, great, great. Um, I'm just gonna stick a medium statue there as well, just to help these evolve. We can get these up to medium insulate, and I don't think I will bother with oil on this. Um, on this block, anyway. Uh, where does oil come from? Is it only a sea trade route? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is gonna be a little tricky. It's gonna be a little tricky. Um... How do I make this work? We'll need to stockpile some oil and just try import enough oil to, uh... So we need to try be a little quicker with boats. So I'm gonna move this pig farm to there. So that I can put a warehouse right here. Oh wait, that will be risky. I'll need to move the clay pits over. Raw material, clay pit. Okay, I'll need to move these houses across. Put a warehouse right here, not touching anything because those fires will spread. Oh. This... Yeah, I need to bring in oil if I want luxury palaces. That's gonna be a problem. Um, where does wine come from, by the way? Same place, same place. So I will open this trade route to import oil and wine. And that might burn down. So what I need to do is I need to have two warehouses on this side set to... getting oil and getting wine and limit those to just eight resources each so mercury doesn't burn it down. Why is this? No, oh, damn. This was supposed to be the opposite. Uh, oh well. That's fine. Uh, because if the wine and oil warehouse burns down, that'll be very costly. But yeah, we want this near the dock so transactions can happen a bit quicker. Oh, all of these warehouses are gonna have... Ah, right. We need to turn all of this off. Uh, make sure oil and wine do not go into these warehouses. So this, this one never burns down, right? So this one is taking clay and pottery. Just to, for my own mental processing there. 
Oh wow, we actually are filling up a second javelin fort. Isn't that interesting? I think pottery is actually overproducing here, so I'm gonna get rid of one pottery workshop. Why are... Uh, why isn't the fruit going into the granary? Wait, what? Did I...? Did I do something though? I didn't, right? Mr. Porkroo says I didn't. Why is this granary resetting? Surely I didn't turn off fruit in the granary. I don't... I don't remember doing that. Look at this. It's not even a problem. It's just a little... Annoying. Yeah, fruit's growing. Look at that. Vegetables sort of stockpiling up as well. Um, I think I will go ahead and... Yeah, let's watch them die. Congratulations, Mars. Nice try. Okay. I'm gonna put down another warehouse here to get vegetables because that's starting to look a little stockpiled. Still alive? Okay, goodbye. Okay. So two layer of towers there should be... Okay, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, are all these houses stabilizing? How's our employment? Okay, I know we're not gonna be evolving these houses anymore, but... I'm just going to give him a library anyway. Is our culture... Our culture is, like, not functioning at all. I'm not sure if our culture is severely held back by the temple thing, but... Worst case, I'll just dump all the temples right at the end of the game. Did we get any... No. No. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure if once we have to start um, supporting luxury palaces if we have to throw some festivals to Neptune. Maybe it's a series locust curse messing with this? I don't know. Maybe... Not sure. Oh, right. That, of course, happened. Okay. <laughs> of course that happened. I forgot I, I did that. Okay. Is this... Why is this... Oh, that's still at five, right? Um, why is wood going in here? Did I do this backwards? I did that backwards. Did I do this backwards? I don't know. I'm not too sure anymore. Oh yeah, we got the Mars curse, so that's there, okay. Furniture, pottery. I think pottery is just about maintaining. Food is starting to stockpile. Okay, that's great. So, with... Wait, look! I definitely did not do that. Something is... going on here. It's a series curse turning off my granaries from accepting food? Really? Yes, yes. This is why I was stockpiling vegetables, because I knew this was coming. Um, oh, we're only short by two. Which one? Ah, of course, of course. Wait. The curses are messing up my settings. This is no longer accepting wine. Really, the curses are messing with 
some of my settings. So I didn't set these wrong. That's probably why something glitched out over here. It's not every warehouse, it's certain warehouses. Okay, I actually have... Okay, that solves the problem. Wait, did I? Does that work? No, that's a visual glitch. Okay. Oh, that worked though. Does that work? No. <laughs> There's some workaround to over there, yeah. Okay, so let's rebuild this. And I've got the 40 vegetables, and is this wrecked the game? It is, it is, okay. This is set to getting fruit. So this sets to... So that's correct. Okay. So that's another bug in this game. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, right, the vegetables. Let's dispatch those, yeah? Okay, we'll continue farming up vegetables for Caesar there. So, is this... Okay. That's gonna be a little difficult to manage. So we actually had too much food, and then suddenly all the food was gone. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh, that granary is glitching out. Maybe if I just rebuild the granary. Maybe that will work. Right? Let, let's try rebuild the granary, and just not mess with the settings. Come on, market lady, just take the food. Okay. Granny. Okay, okay. Someone got very hungry. There was like thousands of units of food in there, and it just disappeared, and it might have something to do with the glitch. Okay, okay. Okay, I, but I think at this point I can start thinking of... we have 13% unemployment. We're not taxing people at all. So I guess we should start taxing people, right? We are... we can pay 8 above Rome, keep people happy, tax people a decent amount. Let's put down a forum right here. So those houses are worth taxing. Food's gonna come back in there. Rome thanks me for those goods. Which one burnt down? That one, okay. So that curse... Does it mess with... Okay, some wine and oil has come in. Okay. I'm not gonna mess with the settings anymore. So, we should have these warehouses coming down to grab the wine and oil. Okay, we'll wait for this to stop burning. I think I will actually just make this a little bit easier by clearing that off. And then I could move furniture workshop to there. Clear that, so that I could... Yeah, get rid of this house. So that I could immediately just rebuild that. To not accepting furniture. Okay. 
I might be able to mitigate this with some control of things. Uh, perhaps I want two docks here. If I clear this, I can move the pottery workshop to there. Get rid of that. Set down a second dock to speed things along when Neptune is not cursing us. Okay, okay. So here comes the second boat, okay. That looks like it's gonna burn. But... Let us just stop importing for now. Do we have enough of this? Seven. Okay, well, let's some um, wine stockpile. We're gonna grab another four to go up there. Okay, grabbing some. Let's bring in some oil. Do we have two units there? Four, eight. Okay, I'll start re importing when we start using it. Oh, I just realized oil will be used here, right? The market lady will take oil? Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. There goes the boats. That's why we need two docks. These houses ran out of food. Really? Maybe I need two markets to try and stabilize things. So wine is stockpiled up here. So I think without a barber, these houses shouldn't evolve. Okay, we brought in that, so that's good. So we imported what we needed to. Still, okay. Let's fix this, because we need the food, farm, fruit. Okay. That is ready to burn. This should be... Why would it just suddenly not accept... Why did a unit of meat come up here? A unit of meat was put here. And it's being gotten to put here. They're getting meat from each other? <laughs> Has culture moved at all? I think it's still at zero. It's still at zero. Um, it's probably the, t the lack of temples. Oh, they do take oil. Okay. So we cannot have oil here. So we're definitely going to need a separate area. But I think now is the time to start thinking of the next area. So I think it's just going to be simplest to have a straight road right here. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. A straight road right here. And we are going to prep. Let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Large statues. Which one? That one. Okay. So every time a curse hits, something gets messed up with my settings. Let me just double check. What is happening? Yeah, this for some reason just becomes not accepting. I want this to... Actually, it's fine if it just accepts everything. What happens to this one? That stays, okay. This one, clay pottery, okay. This one, that's correct. This one, clay pottery meat, yes, okay. This one, 
Okay, I'm not gonna mess with that. Is the granary staying? Okay, rebuilding the building seems to reset it a little bit. That's still getting vegetables, that's still getting vegetables, that's still getting vegetables. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna try get one, two, three, four. Six luxury palaces. Right? Six luxury palaces. We're gonna be invaded again. Okay, money is a little tight. How is... How are we not producing enough food here? I'm very sure this is enough farms. Because we're sending in six, seven, eight, nine, ten, a thousand units of food each wave. Are we really not producing enough? The markets did take oil, unfortunately. Do these houses use oil? Since then, they can't evolve. Do they use oil? Maybe not, maybe not. So maybe it's still fine. Oh, we need more pottery then. Workshop pottery. Let's get that going again. Cards returning from delivery, okay. So, warehouse there. This is getting furniture. Let's see if that works. This should just be accepting furniture. That's just not accepting furniture, okay. Is it because we sold furniture? We sold five units of furniture. Oh, some furniture's been gotten as well, okay. Okay. I think these houses don't use oil, so it's actually fine if that stays there. Farm fruits. Mercury can burn down granaries, right? Engineer's post. I'm just gonna extend the road out here. Stick one right there. Extend the road out here. Stick one right there. Okay. And we'll work on evolving these houses to luxury palaces. Right? Okay, so we're gonna need a gatehouse coming out of here. To hook up to here. Okay. Perhaps not. Perhaps not. Yeah, let's just not have it connected. Okay. Yeah, that's not gonna be a problem. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Instead... Let me clear off some of these trees here. And just try produce what needs to be produced. Yeah, so this can be some farms. Okay, so we can do this. Just send that through. Okay, yeah, that's fine. We actually have some forts of javelins, that's interesting. So I'm going to need... A place to produce... Actually, no. No, I don't need to produce furniture. I can just get that. I don't understand. Surely we have enough farms here. I'm sure we have enough farms. Something weird is going on with that granary. None of this is collapsing. Okay. Reservoir. One, two, three. Which one? That one. Okay. Not the worst. One, two, three. I 
mountain. Okay. Oh. If I move that thing, I could make things a little easier. Convert this. To... Oh, we only need one. So this can maintain large stature. So that covers those four. And then similarly on this side. Okay. We're gonna try get six luxury palaces. Perhaps four, maybe I'll start with four, right? I'll start with four. See if we can support that. Okay. There goes my javelins. All right. I think I can just ignore it, right? I'm gonna set these to just accepting. Set this to just accepting because I'm gonna need to shift those resources over. We're gonna need an engineer's post along this road. I'm just gonna have a nice long straight road here. Houses somewhere in the middle so that I can put down The four resources here, we need to... Uh, this one should be... I'm gonna try get pottery and just see how that works out. Remind me, I just remembered I need to fix that. This is gonna get furniture. This is gonna grab the oil. Now I hope these settings don't mess up. And this is gonna grab the wine. I'll check these settings later. Okay. Granary is still filling, okay. Ran out of pottery, really. Farm, fruit. Nope, wrong. Okay, okay. Are we not producing enough Pottery? I guess not. Okay, so that's gonna grab those over. These houses have moved in, okay? Employment is still fine. Uh, we're gonna need granaries here. Which, hmm. We'll need three granaries. Granary. It would make sense if I used the road for this. So I'm just gonna do this. Granary. One, two, three. And for stability, we need to have... These can burn down, right? Oh well. Actually, no. The these granaries really need to not be touching each other. Uh, I'm just gonna put a house here. This is a probably a big invasion. Let me just set this up. Okay. Those three granaries will be doing their thing. Now, how big is this invasion? This is probably a big one. The series... Oh, I forgot the warehouse down here. Warehouse. We're supposed to be accepting... Just not accepting that. Right? Are these still messing up? This resets to getting furniture. 
and this sets to accepting furniture. This sets to accepting furniture. Okay, I'm just gonna try to do that. Okay. Now this invasion. Now this invasion. I just read three words. Oh, sorry. Does Series Mercy Curse do something with your markets as well? If so, maybe that's why the feeding block is problematic. I'm not sure. It shouldn't be a problem. Let's let's watch these guys die first. Okay. Should I build more towers? This is a pretty big invasion. The chariots haven't even shown up yet. Do I have any troops? I do have troops. Might as well use them, right? Mars will just kill them off anyway. Oh, they're actually charging to the... Are they hitting the wall? Oh, this, this invasion is actually rather large. Shoot them! Shoot them! They destroyed something. A clinic. That was a pretty large invasion. And also, why is my money so low? Have we been selling anything this year? We have. Where did all my money go? The invasions get very large on this one. I'm just gonna drop this. Taxes are actually yielding a decent amount. Huh. Well, there's a boat there now buying some stuff. There we go. Some money's coming back in. Okay. All right. All right. Still got unemployment. Um, these granaries. So we can actually grow all three of these. Vegetables. Fruit. And meat. Okay. Oh, come on! Why? This is why I can't feed this block. This keeps happening. So, this is a problem I was not expecting. The bugs in this game, the bugs in this game, uh, are doing a number on me. <laughs> uh, we actually got some resources now. Huh? Oh. I wanted to up pottery production here. Because this can actually supply pottery to down here as well. Okay, okay. That's still doing fine. Okay, Governor Julio is in chat. Governor Julio, how many farms of each type of food do I need to maintain four luxury palaces? Connect the road to the granaries in the palace area? What do you mean? Oh, are people unhappy? Oh, people love me. If you want to know what cities look like when they burn, watch 
carefully. How is... Venus is still happy, okay. How many farms do I need each? Azure, I'm not sure what you mean about connecting the granaries. Fruit is still going in, okay. Okay, I can ignore that. Two of each, really? Just two? The section of the road is missing? I'm pretty sure it isn't. There's a road there, there's a road there. Oh, okay, no, I was totally wrong. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> two of each, is that enough? It's two of each. It's not so bad. Could just have a road come up here. And then I could one, two, three. Just do this. Just do this. Two vegetables. Two fruits. Ah, uh, let's be smart about this. Fruits on this side, because fruits are good for desirability. Pigs are not. Okay, and we'll just start stockpiling the food there. I'm still curious as to why we can't produce enough food to support this area. Do we really not have enough farms? I can have more now, though. We'll do that. We'll do that. What happened to the furniture here? Ah! Okay. Do these other ones mess up? That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. There's something to do with furniture warehouses. That is an issue. That's maintained. That should be accepting. Yeah, it's something to do with furniture warehouses. Hmm. If that is the case. Well, are you here to buy pottery? Why would you come here to buy... Do we just not have enough pottery to sell, I guess? Oh, we're now producing more pottery here. Is this warehouse okay? Getting pottery, accepting pottery. Uh, getting furniture, accepting pottery. Okay. Okay, well, more fruit farms are there. All of these are now working. Okay. We're short by 50 employees. Which I can just solve by doing this for now. Because I don't really care. Okay. We'll start stockpiling this food into here so that I can start distributing it. Where did the... All right, it's sold, it's sold, right, 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 okay. The first feeding will be a bit of a problem, but I need these houses to evolve so I have the employment to provide everything required to this area. I guess we don't need the library here, right? Okay, okay. Uh, I think at this point, how many, uh... We have 25 vegetables saved up. Which one? That one? Okay. So, does that mess up? Is that the curse? No, that didn't mess things up. I think it's the series curse. 
I think it's a series curse. That's messing up my settings. There are three types of food coming in. We have more fruit farms here, but it's still struggling to feed for some reason. Yeah, so the houses don't use oil unless they evolve, so that's good to know. Uh, you mitigated employment? At least money's gone back up, so I'm not too concerned about that. Is this okay? That's supposed to be getting. Okay. So there's the series curse. Let me check my settings. That's fine. It's the series curse. It converts my... for furniture particularly. It converts accepting to getting getting to accepting and sometimes to not accepting not accepting to getting hmm ah all oh, right and it was a series curse so we need to rebuild all the farms Governor Julio, am I mistaken, or do we really not have enough farms to feed this single block of housing? Do we really not have enough farms for this? Because my sense is telling me this is enough farms to feed all of this. Too concerned about that area right now. This burned down, okay, but we don't need to replace it yet. Not accepting furniture, okay. Getting goods, okay. Wait, didn't I just fix that? Hmm, hmm. Okay. Employment, not too bad. Military takes a hit, okay, that's fine. Oof. Oof. Occasionally granaries or warehouses can become linked to other granaries or warehouses. Changing special orders of one building changes the orders of the other. Now saving and reloading the game will unlink the buildings and reset one of the buildings to its default state, all accepting. Really? Really? Saving and reloading? was supposed to be eaten there. Save the game. Reload the game. Okay, so this is supposed to be not accepting there. This is supposed to be accepting there. This is supposed to be getting there and not accepting and not accepting. That's correct. That's correct. That's correct. Okay. It just reset like a bunch of stuff. Let's see if it stays this way though. Saving and reloading. Huh? Okay. Let's see if this stays as well. And this, getting accepted. Okay, so now I go back to the beginning, check if anything was messed up. So this is not supposed to accept any of this, right? Correct. 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 Uh, 
Are they still linked somehow? Look at that. If I change the fruit setting here, the granary changes here. Watch this, watch this. This probably changed that. Found it. Found it. This warehouse here is linked to fruit in that granary. <laughs> uh, I know how programming works. So once I find the cause of the bug, like the actual reproduction of the bug, this is all just going to continue on forever, huh? Oh well, that's fine. Just You just keep doing that. Okay. 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 <laughs> Restart your PC. Delete system 32. Okay. Okay. This is just... Yeah, that's just a mess as well. I still don't understand how we don't have enough food for this block. Right? It looks so weird. Let me just see. Food is being taken, right? So that was just a couple hundred. So here it starts to stockpile a little bit of fruit. So it's got 500. It's gonna have a lot more soon. The markets used up the food. Okay. So she just took like a bunch of fruit. Should be for this market. So there's 600 fruit in this market being distributed. I think that's the market lady. Used it up. Okay. Okay, so it's starting to restabilize there. I think if I just make sure that glitch doesn't keep happening, it should be fine. Let me check if everything is still... Okay, so I can't change the fruit setting on that. Is this... That's set to accepting. Is this... Not accepting furniture. Okay. 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 Check if the food in the houses is reduced after curse. Okay, I'll have to keep an eye, but... There's 433 in there. I don't think curses affect food in houses, right? You know, I think to maintain this, I'm just gonna evolve one house first. How's our employment? Still short? Is it because people can't move in here? Well... Let's just solve the problem, shall we? Okay. Have yourselves a doctor and an engineer's post. Solved. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Maybe the mercury one? Maybe. Maybe. So all these houses have re-evolved here. Yeah? So it looks like things should be stabilizing, right? Here comes another volley of fruits. So here's the mercury curse. Okay. No, food's still fine there. That burnt down. Okay, warehouse. So just set this to not accepting furniture. Okay. That's fine. Okay, okay. 
So we have the four resources. So we have all the resources we need here. We just need employment to evolve these houses. So let me just real quick get this market down and start evolving this house. Let's get two markets down, right? That makes sense. So we'll start evolving this house here. We can plaza this up preemptively. Might as well. That's where the luxury palaces will be. Let's make sure things evolve where they're supposed to. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So yeah, let's... Fix this. Okay, okay. Farm. Fruit. If we ever do stockpile a little bit of fruit here, we should be fine. No, the contents of the houses seem fine, even after a series curse. Okay. So this is gonna start distributing. We're getting unemployment. So we can start putting down all the stuff we need. I'm gonna stick a reservoir right here. Okay. So I can put down baths. I can put down school. I can put down library. I can put down Forum. I can put down theater. I can put down amphitheater. A small temple to Venus just to start things off. Uh, what else do we need? Uh, we're gonna need the gladiator school the actor colony to get those going. We can stick a Colosseum around the end there, I think. 3,000 people. 3,000 people. <laughs> we are growing. Yeah, Colosseum will fit there. Can I fit the Hippodrome here? I could fit the Hippodrome down this side as well. That's great. We brought in all those tents. I'm sure culture is still zero. I think it's linked to temples. I'm just gonna have to not worry about culture for now. No employees live nearby. Oh, it's because I don't have enough houses. I see. So we do need the four houses. One house isn't enough to provide employment, I think. That's working. Okay. Uh, what else do we need? Um, did I put down a doctor's? I have not. Uh, doctor. Uh, barber. Re okay. Doctor Barber. Okay. We'll need a hospital. Just remembered. Hospital. Okay. We could fit down the Colosseum now. Build a lion house. Move this engineer's post in preparation for the chariots. Buying pottery from here. I wish we could control that, but gonna have to work yeah we need these houses to move in to stabilize employment nothing's collapsing that's the main thing the granaries are pretty full these markets have food okay okay things are starting to come together <laughs> amazingly uh, we're gonna just replace that while we're at it this is just not accepting furniture make sure all other settings are where they're supposed to be because we're selling pottery from up there they're not buying pottery from here which is a little annoying but at least this can 
start getting pottery like that, so we can grab pottery from down there. Oh. We can make a shortcut there. Okay, these houses have moved in. So the markets should be stocked. Okay, lions are coming through. Do we really need to have these houses down? Okay. We need to rebuild all these farms because it's still not quite stabilized. Okay, okay. We're so close to getting things like launched off the ground. It's crazy how close we are. Just needs a little bit of micro. Coliseum is operational. 10% unemployment. Did you consider that luxury houses will need access to three gods? Yes, but building a single temple is not gonna make the gods happy. They're still gonna keep cursing us. I think a single small temple only caters to like 300 people. It's not a lot, it's not a lot. Okay. Come on, give, give me a functioning, give me the working Colosseum cinematic. Is the only thing missing? Okay. So what I actually want to do, yes! We've got a working Colosseum, guys. He's not so happy, I'm very happy. So I'm just gonna make room for another warehouse right here so that I can keep this going. So this is just not accepting timber. Make sure everything else, the settings are remaining. Yes, not accepting furniture, not accepting furniture. Okay, everything else is remaining as correct. Why are the markets not taking food? Academies, right. Uh, I can go right there. Is that too far? It might be too far. Let me just stick it back here. Oh, the market ladies are not walking far enough to touch the houses, so they don't know that the houses need food. You see that? Ah, oh, market ladies. They only walk a short distance. If they don't come, come across a house, they're like, well, I guess there's no one to feed. Who's working at the market then? Okay, there we are. Are you getting some food now? Is it because I placed this house there? So you're gonna start grabbing food, please. Thank you. Okay, so we've got 600 vegetables there. Okay, so they both grabbed food. I can get rid of that house. Because they should now... There is a road connection, right? Yeah. Go distribute the food. People disgruntled. That's not so good. We have money again, so I'm gonna raise that again to eight. That should make people happy. We have distributed food to the four houses. Okay. Is this really enough farms for all of that? Okay, look at that. Now, now we've got plenty of food right there. Uh, I think I can cut back on pottery production here because we need to keep room for furniture there and we don't want that to fill up too much. How's our unemployment? 5%. Guys, can someone tell me what 5% of 3,000 is? 3,400? Let's just save the game real quick. 
I just want this to to get going. I just save the game. So if I just speed it up, what happens? Mars curses. I don't have to care about. Why aren't these evolving? Surely you guys are getting pottery, right? There we go. There's a series crops. We have a stockpile of food, so we don't have to worry about that. They got the three types of food and pottery. Okay, everything else is there. Which one? Okay. I guess that's fine. Alright, this burnt down. Our settings still correct? Yes, we sold furniture. Okay, yes, yes, correct, good. So these are evolving. Needs a supply of oil. Which we do have right there. And... Is there anything we're missing besides... One, two, three, four. Is there anything we're missing besides... Um, the Hippodrome. Just the gods, right? To be fair, I should probably build one temple to each. But look at that, we've got Grand Insulas. Okay, okay, so we just need to build more temples to gods and we can evolve these houses. Guys, guys, look look at how we've, we're actually, we have one culture. <laughs> Prosperity will continue to rise as I get rid of these tents and evolve these houses. But look at that, we've got Grand Insulas prepped for more stuff. We just need to put down a couple temples And the Hippodrome, which can actually fit right here. Look at that. We can fit the Hippodrome right at the edge of the map. And it'll be fine. Uh, we just need to rearrange the road a little bit. But yeah, look at that. Look at that. We're actually getting things done. Alright guys, that's gonna be the end of part two of the final military mission and the final mission in this playthrough. And look at that, we're actually getting things going, we're getting things working, we're dealing with the god curses, there's been a bunch of glitches and bugs holding us back, but we're making it work. And I think in the next part, we can win this with some luxury palaces. Alright, so that's going to be the end of this part. Do click the button on the screen to check out part three, but I hope you enjoyed it, found it interesting, and think this is a suitable final challenge. All right, that's going to be it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.